Excuse me. Who is she and what's she doing here? Let's go to work with your parent, Dave. Mm. She's your daughter. Something like that. But of course, if you're too afraid to have her here, she doesn't have to be here. Well, fine with me if she stays, since this is going to be the world's shortest deposition. Because you're ready to admit you infringed on my client's patent to create your generic knockoff? Because my company developed that drug from scratch, and your client has no proof we didn't. Actually, we do have proof. We're just not going to use it. <laughs> you're not going to use it because it doesn't exist. I'm not going to use it because I'd like you to lie to my face in this deposition. And why is that? So when I reveal what we know in open court, you not only lose this case, you get charged with perjury. Can't you get sent to jail for that? Why, yes, Joy, you can. But you'd probably go bankrupt first trying to fight it. Mm. Mm. You're bluffing. You don't have shit on them. I guess there's only one way to find out. So, Mr. Coleman, did you or did you not rip off our patent to create your bullshit new drug? And before you answer, I'd like you to think back to that decaf latte you were drinking before coming up here. And more specifically to the person waiting in line by your table while you were trying so hard not to look at me. That's what she's doing here. You set us up. You set yourself up. Because you went to a public place and discussed a case loud enough for a 15-year-old girl who just happened to be recording the coffee shop to pick you up on tape. Now, for the last time, where'd your new drug come from? <sighs> All right. How much do you want? 